today, October the 7th, is our commencement date for resumption of school at Sheridan Primary School. Therefore, we have had a number of persons on the premises to assist us. We have had persons to help with the furniture um, so that classes can be reconfigured, moving heavy, heavy covers, such like. We have had janitors being on the premises since 6.30 in order to accommodate those persons who would assist us at seven. We have had teachers, some teachers being on the premises from seven o'clock also in order to assist. Also persons from the Church of God who usually prepare the breakfast for our breakfast program. Today, as I have said to parents, is our unofficial open day. We left here during Monday of week two, and both parents and children have returned to premises that have been repaired. There are many repairs that have been done, and from what I have seen on the chats, I have seen that parents are extremely thankful. As I have said before, we are thankful for being, for being accommodated at the Seven Days Adventist Church and at Holy Innocence Primary School. And we thank the ministry for organizing that. We thank the board of directors, all of that. But there's no place like home. And this morning, I received lots of hugs from children who said, Ma'am, I am so happy to be at school. I read some of the messages from parents, and as I have said before, parents are also extremely happy, not only to return to Sharon, but to return to a refurbished premises. So many things have been done. And that is why this morning we are actually continuing our thankful spirit. And as I have told someone, we are counting our blessings. We are not saying that things cannot happen, but we are saying that with the cooperation of parents and, and, and especially those parents who are knowledgeable in aspects of environmental health and also engineering, Parents who know about paints and, 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 and air filtrations and systems, all of those things. We are blessed to have those kinds of parents at Sharon. And those are ones who, some of them are here today, that they are able to testify of the improvements we have here at Sharon.